What is up, guys? It's Scott with Never Hedge back for another MMAT update. Uh, and we are getting pretty thoroughly pounded today. Uh, no surprise there, as uh, we're seeing another bit of a sell off uh, before the end of the quarter, <clears throat> end of the month. Uh, I think the shorts are hammering us pretty good today. Uh, not worried about it at all. Uh, let's go down quickly to the RSI sitting at 38.65. MACDs are looking rather bearish right now as we're seeing this uh, sell-off going on. But a uh, good, good chance to get, get a couple more shares at a, at a discount here, 10% off. Uh, I did find an interesting uh, take on this today uh, from the Mr. Mr. King of Ape. As he puts it, this is an important update. Meta Materials Inc. Important update. Uh, I'm not just pretend he's yelling here. I'm not going to yell though. Uh, you guys aren't going to like that. Good morning. Hope all of you are feeling better today. So let's clear some things up. Many of you, a reverse merger margin call due to the merger, are now seeing that you're no longer in a margin call. This is because the clearinghouse changed the margin requirement from 100% to 50%, which should have been in effect prior to the merger, but it's a good thing that they adjust. Also, many are asking about their preferred dividend. All brokerages are waiting on allocation from the DTC and should make your preferred dividends available to you by Wednesday or Friday at the latest. The reason for this is due to the APEX slowly processing of the ACH. However, you should have provisional credit on your brokerages and if you held June 22nd, 2021 or prior through June 25th, 2021, today will be an interesting day as many of you await to see if shorts cover. Stress again, if you are here for a short squeeze, you may be disappointed. Keyword, MMAT is not a meme. It's a company that will play a big role in the nanotechnology field as many and has many verdicts. They work in EV, medical, optical, augmented, and mixed reality, to name a few. Expect partnerships and contracts this year in the EV market as well as medical field. More of these potential partnerships will be discussed on the live webcast July 6th, 2021 by CEO of MMAT. You heard it here first. King Ape is long on MMAT, and MMAT will reach 100 plus organically. This is another... Uh, important message here from hello steve 1010 uh so the first thing here i want to get to is the ceo turned down hedge funds 500 million dollar offer so that is from here june 20 first uh, turn down investment bank offers 500 million unsolicited bought deal no can do no limit no discount no deal and merger is still in the process okay stop asking why everyone or google your broker tells you all shorts have to cover by today and why isn't there a squeeze? It's because the merger is still in process. Look at nasdaq.com, check institutional holding. Page is error 404, which means the account accountants and SEC are still working on the books. Yes, the ticker has changed, but how many shares do the hedge funds have to cover and who has what holding? If they can't entirely figure that out, how can you ask anyone to cover let alone margin? And so basically, uh, the merger is still in process, and we're going to have to wait for that to complete, which again could be as early as tomorrow, maybe July 1st, uh, the first of the month. Again, this, these things take a little bit of time. Uh, again, they had to change the ticker due to the T plus two rule, and we have a potential Tesla partnership. Uh, check out these posts. You guys will be very happy. Tesla and Meta TRCH connections and possible partnership. Stay calm. There's a lot going on behind the curtain. I know it sucks not knowing, but when the fog clears, it will be clear skies and sunny, and we will end on that positive note. Enough of this nonsense, guys. As always, please make sure you're subscribed to the channel for more updates on MMAT, as well as other stocks and tokens we like. And I thank you guys so much for watching this far, and I'll see you in the next video.